this land is your land, <laughs> this land is my land at the time. Yeah. <laughs> Chief Tidwell, thanks so much for your service. Uh, we really appreciate it. And on behalf of Idahoans, I can tell you that uh, uh, you've just been uh, a pleasure to work with, and uh, I found you to be reasonable, and hope we continue with that relationship uh, as the over the next uh, 694 days as uh, we uh, move along. Um, I, I do want to put a couple of things on your uh, on your radar screen. First of all, I know you were a big uh, proponent of uh, the forestry section in the far the 2014 Farm Bill, and we had high hopes for the, ex uh, the categorical exclusion uh, from the NEPA process in there. Well, the first one we tried is the Jasper Mountain Project. I don't know if you're familiar with it or not. You might mark that down. It's about 3,000 acres. And uh, they tried to use the uh, designation by prescription and a designation uh, by description processes to move the thing forward. And uh, as fate would have it, uh, they're high centered with all four wheels spinning now because they say they couldn't use those in this particular situation. So I'd appreciate it if you'd have a look at that. Um, yes. We, I mean, it was, uh, it, this is something you and I were both uh, excited about, and now here we got the first one, and, um, and uh, uh, the wheels have come off. So if you could take a look at that, I would appreciate it. Uh, the second thing that uh, I, I think my staff's talked to years and told you that I was going to ask you about this, but in 1980, the Central Idaho Wilderness Act was passed, and it was... I think you may have been living in Idaho in 1980 at the time, and uh, uh, in any event, as you recall, it was a very controversial, but we were patted on the head and told that everything was going to be all right, and uh, one of the provisions in there was the people who uh, fly into the back country, and as you know, in Idaho, that's a, uh, mm -hmm. that's a big deal, and there's uh, a number of uh, uh, back country uh, airports that have been used for decades back there. Section 7A1 of the uh, Central Idaho Wilderness Act states, the landing of aircraft where this use has become established prior to the date of enactment of this act shall be permitted to continue. Um, I'm told the Payette National Forest Supervisor has proposed closing four of those airstrips. And so you might send a little memo when you get back to your desk about that and send them maybe a copy of the section because uh, I'm just a poor country lawyer, but it seems to me shall mean shall, and I know the Forest Service hates getting sued, but this looks like one that's uh, set up to, uh, to be a lawsuit if, uh, if they proceed with that. I, I understand they may not want to do it anymore, but the 1980 Act is uh, pretty clear about that, so appreciate it if you'd have a look at that. And again, thanks for your service. Thank you, Senator Flake. Thank you, Madam.